restaurant Eve in Virginia to see how Dublin born chef Cathal Armstrong is serving up some traditional Irish cuisine. Check him out. What are you wants to, one sea seek, nothing before, played it. My name is Cahal Armstrong, I'm the chef and owner at Restaurant Eve in Alexandria, Virginia. Restaurant Eve is a locally sourced farm to table restaurant. Certainly, it has a distinct influence from my homeland. We bring a lot of Irish ingredients to the table. We focus very much on the thing that the Irish, I think, are most famous for is their hospitality. So, thanks for coming for lunch today. Hope everything's great. Delicious. You know, it really shocks me how much Irish food is still misunderstood. When I talk to people that go visit Ireland, they come back and go, wow, the food is great. As a kid growing up in Ireland, St. Patrick's Day was a day where, you know, you get up in the morning, put something green on, go to church, then go home for a great meal. That looks delicious. Without fail, we always had lamb. We don't really eat corned beef, <laughs> which most people are kind of shocked when I tell them that. Leg of lamb. It's a much more traditional Irish thing to eat. Nice. Today we're making a traditional St. Patrick's Day celebration meal, the roast leg of spring lamb. So we're going to make a little herb pesto just to embellish the lamb. This has all the flavors of the spring in here. Oh, I mean, it has that beautiful spring smell. Mmm, delicious. We're going to show you how to make the perfect creamy potato dish. This is Irish cobbler potato. For us, you can take your caviar. A good roasted potato is way better. When I was taught how to do this, my chef said that you have to do it as if the devil is chasing you. So once the cream is hot, we can start to add our potatoes. The idea here is to get layers of cream and potato, potato and cream. So we just kind of deal it in almost like a, as if you would deal out a deck of cards. Our leg of lamb is ready. Looks beautiful. Right before we carve the lamb, we're going to put our pesto on. The natural heat from the lamb is going to cook the garlic and the rosemary and the thyme and the basil, and the whole thing will become integrated, you know, so here we are. We're integrating the Irish. You can see how perfectly cooked that lamb is. The best part of carving is you're the first one to taste it. So I have some carrots from one of my farms and some beautiful peas that are just coming in the season now. So we're just going to add a little bit of butter to the pan. Let them simmer away. We can check our potato gratin. And there it is. Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, I'm ready to eat. And there we go. All the joys of spring. <laughs> Anytime we get an opportunity to use an Irish ingredient here or create an Irish dish at Restaurant Eve, it's an opportunity for me to influence people. And if we just convince one person about how amazing the food can be in Ireland, that's success. La Fela Poirik Deep Galeb. So at the end, he said, um, Happy St. Patrick's Day in Gaelic, and I thought we should all take a stab at saying it together. I'm going to say it first. Okay, ready? La Fela Padrig Div Galer. Wow. Okay. Wow, that, was that was, you know, epic. Um, on the, here on the board, we have it written out phonetically. Okay, on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Wow. La Fela Padrig Div Galer. I think it'll sound much better after a few Guinnesses. All right, up next, Mario's in the kitchen with that Irish pub grub. Don't go away. Coming up, our audience gets the chance to win fabulous prizes and cold, hard cash. That's coming up in just a moment. If you have type 2 diabetes, you may know what it's like to deal with high and low blood sugar. Genuvia Citagliptin is a once-daily pill that, along with diet and exercise, helps lower blood sugar. Genuvia works when your blood sugar is high and works less when your blood sugar is low because it works by enhancing your body's own ability to lower blood sugar.